What do we think of the lipstick colors, Lulu? What do we think? Huh? You want kisses? Like every man, you don't want kisses when I have a lipstick on. <laughs> what have you got? If you haven't got, haven't got love. Hello, tips and tricksters. Welcome back to another tips and tricks video. Today's video is going to be all about my favorite red lipsticks. I get asked all the time on YouTube and Instagram about what lipstick I'm wearing. So I thought the best thing to do would be to just show you my whole collection and then you'll be able to see the differences between the colors. Before we get any further, a quick word from today's video sponsor. A big thank you to today's sponsor who are Sharecart. I love the concept of this company because what they are is a browser extension that allows you to share your shopping lists and your cart with other people. So for example, birthday lists, wish lists, Christmas lists, all ready to go in the retailers that you love and you can just share them with your friends and family so they're ready to purchase. What I especially love about them is that it's not just big retailers that we're really familiar with. Of course, you can do things like share an Amazon list, but I personally went and tried it on eBay and Etsy and voila it works if your retailer isn't available you can also suggest retailers for future updates as well it is as simple as adding your extension to your favorite browser going to the websites that you like to shop on and adding items to the cart at the end you go up to the extension click the little button and share your cart so a big thank you to share a cart for sponsoring today's video if you're interested in checking out the extension it is linked down below i've also popped my cart link down below as well let's get back to the video I'm going to start with lipsticks, obviously, because they're easier to get off. It will just make life smoother for me making this video. I really like the Morphe formula. They're very affordable and they do have a whole bunch of vegan options as well. So I would recommend their lipsticks. I've got two colors here. One is a very classic kind of pinup red and the other one is more of an everyday kind of rusty red that I love to wear. So I'm going to show you these two. The first is a creamy formula in a rusty red kind of color. I love this, it's just an everyday lipstick. It goes with so many different things and it's just not quite as like in your face as a classic red is. So let's see how this looks on. The next red is a super matte formula from Morphe. I have been wearing this pretty much all the time since Christmas, which is when I got it as a gift. It is super, super bold red, really bright, very true red, like right in the middle of between blue and orange. And I just really like the formula because it is a lipstick, but it is a very matte, quite a dry formula, which I prefer because it just doesn't go everywhere and it doesn't need much retouching. The next two shades come via KVD Beauty, who used to be Kat Von D Beauty and has been since bought out, which might be a relief to some of you. So there are two shades that I really like wearing from these guys. There is also another shade called Outlaw that I really like, but I don't have at the moment, but you might want to check that out as well. The first color is Santa Sangre or Santa Sangre. This is a color that I wear all the time. It is more of an orange red and it is the other most popular color I get asked about on my Instagram. So if it is a more orange red that you're wondering about, it's probably this one. My lips are gradually getting rubbed absolutely raw. <laughs> I have a nice halo of red around here. <laughs> For anyone who's gonna ask, the remover that I use is just soap. Plain old soap. And I do use micellar water sometimes, but micellar water definitely does not get red lipstick off. Soap all the way. The other Kat Von D color that I love is Nosferatu. 
This is a much deeper red. I tend to wear this when I do 30s looks and when I'm going out in the evening. It's pretty dark for a daytime look unless you're more into a dark look overall and that's your style, which is cool. But for me, I tend to wear this in the evening. So I'll show you what it looks like on. Last but not least, we have a new favorite, which is by Daphna. If you didn't see my full review video, I will link it up above here. I went through the whole pinup kit that she released recently, but I really love this lipstick. It is a super true classic red. I love the formula. It is a liquid lipstick, but it takes quite a while to dry. So you have like time to work with it and get it right without it peeling or kind of, you know, drying in a weird patchy fashion. Love, 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 love. So guys, that is my collection of red lipsticks and that's the video. I hope you liked it. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment and subscribe. It really helps out my video and my channel. So I always really appreciate it when you do that. I also have a Patreon where I have exclusive content. We have a monthly movie club where we watch movies together and discuss. There are curated vintage finds where I share weekly links to vintage pieces across the internet and around the world and other perks as well. And of course, another big thank you to today's sponsor, Share a Card. Without sponsors like Share a Cart, I couldn't put as much time and energy into the videos that I do. So, of course, a big thank you for them. Do check the links out down below that I mentioned earlier in the video. Otherwise, feel free to come and follow me on my Instagram, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.